What's up, gamers? It's your boy, Launchpad 1412. Excited to be back with some Madden 23 gameplay here. We have episode one of the Super Revamp Follow the Leader series. How this series goes, we hit that random pick button three times for the first episode. First episode only. Whatever team we land on, we pick. And luckily, we got the Green Bay Packers. And what we do for the next game is we're going to play with the build because our opponent has the builds. And we're just going to keep this going until Madden 24. Now, I did do the series two times earlier in the year, <laughs> in the Madden year. But I felt like you guys wasn't paying attention to it. So I just I just left it alone. But you got a couple of you guys asked for it. I think it was a combination of four y'all. Y'all asked for it back. And I'm like, you know, hey, I'll bring it back. You know, we got the random pick series back. And we got the alphabet series back. Why not bring this one back? You know, why? <laughs> I think it's a fun series, man. I do have fun with it. You know, I just try not to post stuff you guys don't want. But obviously, you know, you guys want it. So I feel good about bringing it back. And I'm just excited to see who we're going to play with next. So our opponent has a build. We don't have a bad opponent. This is a pretty good game. This is a fun game to watch. So definitely pay attention to the highlights and, and just kick back and enjoy me <laughs> commentating on um, this game. So he got the pill to see what he could do. Uh, James, was that James Cook with the break tackle? I'm like, oh my goodness. Sneaky nice. And he goes over the middle. Beautiful pass by my opponent to the tight end. I believe that's Dawson Knox. Goes over the middle again. Caught me in the hurry up. I wish they would take Harry up out of the game except for the last two minutes of the second quarter and the fourth quarter. I really think they need to get back to doing that because it's just so easy to score <laughs> when you only have, you know, with a, with a rushing touchdown, when you only have three linemen down. And people do hurry up offense when you're at the three. I'm just like, man, is that, is that really skillful? I don't know. First down to 10. No, we, we go, we getting pass happy in this game. And we go deep. And this was a bad decision. Then again, I thought I had him one-on-one. -on -one. Like, the guy that picked him off, Hyde, I didn't even see Hyde, man. I saw him, but it didn't look like he was going to guard the tight end. It looked like he was going somewhere else. So I was like, okay, it's one-on-one. -on -one. Let me just take a shot. You know, shot deep. You guys know I like, <laughs> guys know I like throwing the ball deep, man. You know, we just took a shot and didn't work. Fourth down to seven, we ended up hitting him as he um, uh, threw the ball. So, you know, we're cooking with a little bit of gas, seven to seven. Bottom of the uh, second half, I'm sorry, second quarter. Uh, bottom of the first half, we go right over the middle. I believe that is uh, Randall Cobb we hit up right there. So we hit Randall Cobb, he gets a nice catch. We end up getting the field goal right before the half. I wanted to go for it so bad, though. I wanted to go, I wanted to, <laughs> I wanted to go for the touchdown so bad, but it's all good, man. 10-7, to 7, we'll, we'll take that, and we'll also take the ball at half. That's why I love getting the ball at half, because no matter what the score is, you get the ball, you get an opportunity to either try to come back on your opponent, take the lead, or you get an opportunity to go up two possessions. So it, it, it's always paramount to me that I get the ball at half. As we get a huge game right here, it's your boy, Aaron Jones, man. This guy used to be one of my favorite players to pick in fantasy football. I might fall back from him a little bit this year. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Though. I, guess, I guess if we come to the land, like mm, the right landing spot, you know, I'll draft him. But, you know, we'll cross that bridge when we get down. First down to 10, we hit Aaron Jones again. I, I was like, man, I got to give him this one, man. He deserved this <laughs> touchdown for that drive. That huge run, he didn't get to score. If that was Flash, he would have scored. <laughs> you know, Flash over my mud team. You know, that boy is a beast. First down to 10 for our opponent. And go, dude, good pass, man. My goodness, under pressure, too. Good pass by our opponent. Same thing, hurry up offense and, and scores like this again. That's why I said, man, they got to. They got to get that hurry up offense out, out, out of there, man. I, I'm way, he's way back at the 20, 30 yard line. I'm not thinking he's going to be on goal line defense the next play. <laughs> My goodness, man. Who, who thought of that? Like, that's just, I don't know, just where I, I know in real life is different, but a video game, you got to have a little bit, we got to have some context a little bit. It's a video game. Okay, I know it's simulation, but it's a video game. It's a lot easier to score versus, you know, in real life, you could switch, you know, I, th I think you could switch, like, you know, players and stuff and switch linemen and all that if you do it. Uh, fast enough, if I'm not mistaken. First down to 10. We're trying to get into the end zone. We go right over the middle. Hit Christian Watson. It's your ball. <laughs> that touchdown felt amazing, man. That, I don't know why, but it just felt good to get that moment. Right over the middle, Christian Watson. You know, someone that I, I'm looking to get in a lot of my fantasy football leagues. He was my, kind of, he was, he, honestly, he was my favorite rookie to come out last year as far as raw receivers. So, it was nice to get a touchdown with him. We get an interception right here, and this is going to be all she wrote. Our opponent is out. We beat him 24-14, to 14, uh, taking a 1-0 record in the series. We want to know. We're going to try to go undefeated. We know that's going to be impossible. We're going to try to go. <laughs> We're going to try to go undefeated, man. So, so 1-0, it feels good. We made our opponent quit. That feels good as well. 24-14, sound victory. I, who I think was a, a pretty sound 
opponent. It's just the Packers, man. They just they a tough team to beat on this game. I, I unless you just unless you're just not good at it. But if you're any type of good, I, I don't think it matters. You know who you are. I think with the Packers, you know, as long as you're decent, the game you can give you, you give yourself a good chance to win with the Packers. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We have up episode two as soon as possible. This is your boy Launchpad fourteen twelve, and I'm out.